Today are Johnny Herbert and David Coulthard, who happen to be Formula One drivers, so they are misses. Thanks for coming in this morning, boys. No problem. For getting up. No problem. Yeah, getting up. You're supposed to say thanks for having me, Josie. I think, <laughs> I think that's, that's what's Sorry. polite in my circles. No, seriously, now, this, this evening on BBC One at 8 o'clock, it's the Sports Review of the Year. And I was wondering what perhaps your highlight of 1996 was, sports wise, boys. Well, <laughs> as it looks like I'm going first, uh, my highlight was uh, definitely leading in Imola because that was mm -hmm. the first time that I'd led a race for McLaren. It was the first time that they'd led a race properly uh, for a year or so. Uh -huh. So that was that was fantastic. It was good fun. And did you think you were going to win while you were leading? Yeah, I was convinced I was going to win. It's... And tell everyone what happened then. Uh, we had a mechanical failure, so yes. I stopped after 30 laps. Okay, so you almost won, really. I, I won say. in my mind, so that's in your mind. Thing, you're yeah. a winner. Yeah. Fantastic. And uh, what about you, Johnny? What was your highlight this year? Uh, well, I think result-wise, I think it had to be third in Monaco. Mm -hmm. uh, I wouldn't say it was my best race, but I think it was just for for me personally. It was good to get the uh, third in. And you're part of the team there. Yes, so yeah. it was good for the team as well. Yeah, yeah, you're a team player, Johnny, as am I. Now, we've been taking calls for you guys, and anyone who gets their call are sort of on air gets a video of a film like Toy Story or Jumanji. You like those films, yeah? Yeah, yeah Jumanji, I think. I'll get Jumanji. see them? Oh, well, seen them, no. <laughs> never mind, but I'll tell you what, it was a really good incentive to get people to ask you questions, because Sally took it up. Hi, Sally. Hello. How are you? Fine, thank you. And where are you calling from? Hull. Oh, well, Sally from Hull, what is your question for Johnny and David? Um, what is the most difficult track you've ever drove on and why? Ooh. Well, the, the most difficult track is definitely Monaco. And uh, the reason for that is that if you make one little mistake, you're in the barrier. So uh, you have to be very careful on that circuit. Oh, really? Would you say the same as well then, Johnny? Yeah, because it's, it's, it's a two-hour race and the concentration has to be so high. And as David says, if you And how fast you are you going mistake, for two hours, do you think? I, I'm not sure what the average is. The average is like 100 and something I think oh no it's about 97 actually I think the average but you For can get up hours. to a, a top speed about 280 k's like oh that. my goodness well Sally very good question yeah, has that answered you. it for you yes thank you and um, can I have the autographs please not a problem yes, Sally no problem. thanks for your call bye. bye bye now you talk about Monaco and all the other places you go is it quite a glamorous lifestyle then uh, well, Monaco is, uh, of course, quite different to anywhere else in, in Europe. It's its own uh, little principality. It's uh, the Grand Prix of the year, isn't it? All the, yeah. uh, all the people want to go there if it's uh. one of the main Grand Prix. And uh, I guess you could say from that respect, it is quite glamorous. Ooh. Now, Kavinda's on the line. Hi, Kavinda. Hi. What's your question for the boys? Um, do you think Damon Hill will win the uh, World Championship next season? Ooh, let's have a prediction. <laughs> Well, I think it'll be he very watches, difficult. You know. Yeah, it'll be very <laughs> difficult for him to win the World Championship. He's changing teams, and uh, the Arrows team, I think, only scored one point in '96. But I'm sure they'll do better in '97. Ooh, has that answered your question, Kavinda? Yep. And there's a video on its way to you as well. Thanks for calling. Bye-bye. Okay, bye. bye. Well, these guys are going to hang around, and the lines are still open. Time now for a bit of cartoon action. It's time for the mask. Who is it, Ace Ventura? and Ship to Shore, which is the next programme, to catch a spy. And we still have our two special guests, who are David Coulthard and also Johnny Herbert, who are in the studio. A little bit later on, we have a very special, special little game for them to play, but right now they're in the studio with Josie. Yeah, they're right over here with me, these boys. Now, boys, 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 we're looking for a good time. And we've been asking our viewers to phone in with questions for you, and they've done that. And I think Lawrence is on the line. Hello, Lawrence. Hello. How are you? OK. Are you a bit of a racing fan? Yep. Excellent, excellent. Well, Johnny and David are waiting for your question. What happens if during a race you get an itch, or oh. even worse, you need the loo? <laughs> right. I, I know the answer to this one uh, on behalf of Johnny because I've never done this, but I know that Johnny pees in the car. <laughs> don't you, Johnny? Yeah, so. Well, I would natural. never do that. I would never natural. do that because my mechanics, I don't want to have to clean it up. I don't tell him. Yeah. <laughs> tell him after. Oh, what about the itch? <laughs> I don't know, just itch. Changing the subject. He's a scratch. He's a scratch. Yeah. OK, OK, excellent. Thank you for your question, Lawrence. Can we have, can we have your autograph, please? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sure. No worries. I will send it to you. Thank you very much. Bye. OK, Stacey. Hi. Hello to you. Where are you calling from, Stacey? North Wales. North Wales. Thank you to you in North Wales. And what's your question? Um, when you're on the podium, who would you like to shower with champagne at the end? Josie. Oh, stop it, yeah. boys. Oh, boys, you're going to be all embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> Who else would you like Who to else? get under that show? <laughs> well, I'm Josie as well. So. <laughs> I'm, uh, well, I'm being no, Scottish, I'm naturally quite tight, so I want to drink Why? it all myself and uh, I don't want to spray it on anyone. 
Okay, sure. Stacey. Yep. Yep. I'll, okay. I'll we'll get a special pen and sign that for you. Later. Now, tonight's a big night because it is um, it's um, the um, sports review of the year, of course it is. And uh, are you to go? Yes, yeah, I think we're really yeah. It's going to be a shock news, I think, when we're there. Do you already know who sort of won? Or... Yes, I do. Are you lying? <laughs> no. Yes, Sorry? he is. Yes, he is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are you like? And who do you think should win sports personality? Johnny. <laughs> Josie. Right. <laughs> They're friends now, Chris, yeah, but they yeah. won't be for long. A little bit later on, we're going to try and divide that friendship by playing a game of Skeletrix. Mm -hmm. Formula One style. A little bit later, it's coming. You're right about that, guys. Good, good, Pressure. good. Here's Pressure. Ship to Shore. And I am having my very own boy bliss right here, right now, with Johnny Herbert and David Coulthard, who, of course, are Formula One racing drivers. Now, we're going to challenge them a bit later on. By the way, if you want to call the guys, the lines are now closed. We're challenging you later on to a game of Scale Electric. Now, would you say this was sort of comparable to the real experience? Um, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's all we could do, OK? So just be grateful. These guys are going to hang around. In fact, I will give you a chocolate finger. And a cup of tea, yeah. just to keep you happy while you play Excellent. this. In the meantime, it's time to go back to school vintage style with Grange Hill.